again, try to fit you into their black box. And that's not the place you want to be because you are defining your own version of black. I never saw that um, about black. I never saw myself as better than anybody. I never saw myself as, you know, more prettier than someone. And I was just trying to live my life. And many light-skinned people, what we're trying to do is just live our life and get through a day. And because these spellbound people are out here with this whole light-skinned, dark-skinned stuff, again, they start projecting ideas onto us, saying things that we are, you know, better than they are, and we want to, and we are um, trying to avoid them. And in some cases, you are trying to avoid them because their behavior and their actions, you know, can pretty much get you hurt because this person is emotional, this person is taking ideas that they have, and they're, because they have these ideas, they're going to act in a way that's going to put your life at risk. Because I've run into cases where guys want to fight and stuff, and you just don't want to deal with these kind of guys, and, the, and in some of the cases, these females, because, again, they don't see you as a person. They are getting emotional and upset based on a skin tone and judging you by the color of your skin, but not the content of your character. And that's a big part of the dark side of white skin, because a lot of people, again, they don't see light-skinned people as people in the black community. They see them as objects, and they see them as someone to be a piece of social currency, and when they see them as pieces of social currency, they look to change them in ways that hopefully can get them attention from other black people in their social circles. And this is one of the big problems of being a light-skinned person or a biracial person in the black community is that you just don't get seen as a person, you don't get valued as a person, and you don't get valued for the content of your character. Now, I explore this whole dark side of light skin again in my new novel, Spellbound, and I really wanted people to understand that light skin pe is light skin people are people, they have feelings, they have emotions, and you want to get to know them as people because I would like to believe that black people could stop judging light skinned people by the color of their skin and really start making efforts to judge them by the content of their character. You can pick up Spellbound in paperback on Amazon.com and online booksellers, and it's also available on e readers such as Kindle, Smashwords, Nook, and the iBookstore.